Hey guys, welcome back. This is Bradicus with Bradicus Games. I am bringing you a Let's Play. We're going to be doing Let's Play Romance of the Three Kingdoms 14. Uh, we are going to be playing the Yellow Turban Rebelling starting in AD 184. Uh, I've decided we're going to go yeah, ahead and play as He Jin. Um, so my goal with this game is just to conquer the Yellow Turban Rebellion. Um, keeping it historic and then uh, we're gonna uh, go from there we're gonna go on to some other campaigns um, I can do a full map conquering which I may end up completing uh, but right now it's just you know I want to do the historical stuff uh, beat down the yellow turbans and then we will go on to some other um, other uh, uh, scenarios and try those out so let's go ahead and jump in and get started I have he selected here we're gonna be playing on hard mode and everything else we're going to be keeping uh, exactly the same. Okay. We're going to go ahead and uh, skip over this flavor text. Uh, this is the Oath of the Peach Garden. It is an event that gets triggered at the beginning of this scenario. Skip that. All right. So here we got our map. Uh, we have a district already set up here. Uh, I'm going to leave that alone for the first few turns. Just let them do their thing. I'm going to be focusing on getting these two cities set up and ready to roll. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and reward everybody. Let's go into sanctions. Looking for any recruits. There we go. And done with that. We're going to reward these guys. We're going to go into our appointments and our administration. I am going to get orders increased immediately. But I'm going to need quite a few. And then we will also go into support here. Uh, I think we're going to increase the morale limits. Because we are going to need that later on. And then uh, we're going to go with Confucian here, uh, Speed and Development, and um, we'll do two of those. Yeah. Okay. And that should be good in there for right now. We have two more orders to start out the turn. Actually, I'm going to use one of those. I want to start a march here. Oops, not a merchant, a march. I'm going to choose this guy. Make sure he has snake. He does. And we are going to get him marching. Actually, let's grab this one, this one, this one, and then to there. Minanomono! Okay. And actually for our last thing, um, yeah, we're going to do a search. Chin Lu. Search. And go ahead and end our first turn. As you can see, our district's going out and conquering areas. Okay, the next thing we're gonna do, the next turn, we're just gonna start rewarding everybody. Jump into sanctions, we're going to, no, we're gonna recruit. And recruit again. And recruit again. And let's go ahead and reward these guys. Okay, and we're going to go into domestics here. Actually, let's go ahead and pull the city out of your division. What we're going to 
do is we are going to summon our best officers here. Let's go ahead and summon him, him, not him. Okay. This guy's moved. We're going to set up a city government here. Dian Wei is still returning, but uh, actually, let's set him as. Let's, let's reverse this. So. No. Yes, yes, that's correct. Tell him. Yeah. And leadership, we don't want him. Wagata. Okay, let's go ahead and set up our domestics here. I'm going to start with agriculture. Okay, and then let's go ahead and set up couple guys here for barracks, ones that are not moving, so him, and he will do fine. Set up a couple more, actually let's go to intelligence, let's get some commerce set up here. Here we'll set up one more commerce and then one more egg. And you can see why I chose to go with orders right off the bat here is because I'm just doing tons and tons of setup. Okay, this city is completely set. We're gonna move, transfer the rest of the guys in here. Chang An, anybody who is not an overseer right now, except for He Jin. Okay. And we're actually going to move He Jin to Chinma. Okay, so I'm making this city right here a uh, backup city because it is completely um, surrounded by friendly forces. So I don't need all my best guys here or anything like that. This is just going to be a troop hub. I'm going to use it to um, uh, keep troops and develop troops and stuff like that. That's why I have a couple barracks and stuff already rolling on it. Uh, the next thing we're going to do is we are going to start transferring our troops uh, out of the gates because I don't need them there. These guys up here, I'm going to go ahead and get them out of where they're at. Okay, we got four more orders. The guy, there's a guy in here that needs to go. We'll just go ahead and send Chen because he's not doing anything at all right now. Okay. And then we're going to transport troops out of here. Uh, him. We're going to transport him in to here, but we're going to have him enter. Actually, you know what? No. Yes. Yes, I'm exactly what we're going to do. And then we're going to move, transport the troops 
from in here. Into here. We're gonna have him enter though. You cool. And then the last guy here, we're gonna have him transfer out of the base. So I don't have any guys just sitting around in the gates. Although that's nice, you know, you can transport troops and through the gates and stuff like that. There's nobody that's going to be coming up and touching these gates, so. And then uh, let's go ahead and move to the next turn. Okay, so next, let's just double check the city. It's good there. It's good there. We are going to march out a unit. Uh, let's see if we have an arrow or something. He's fine. Okay, and we're gonna come up and we're gonna grab this one. We're gonna relay him back. I'm gonna enter the base. The reason why I'm focused on that one here is because I'm going to grab multiple ones with just landing this one. Because this is a surround and conquer. That little blue icon means that when it's when you capture this one, you're going to capture ones around it. Now I might only get these three, but um, you know, instead of walking up here and then walking down here or walking down here and then up here, I'm just going to walk straight to this one and then come back. I might even catch this one up here if I can get there before this guy does. I doubt it though. Okay, now let's go ahead and do our basics. Let's reward everybody. I need to move anybody out of the city to Chin Lu. I think we have a couple of them. And then let's go ahead and set up Chang'e. Alrighty, uh, we are going to set a couple ports here. I like to set the ports as my commerce, it's just a habit. I'm going to set the gate as a barracks, because I like that, I know where my barracks are. Um, I don't really have anybody with a whole lot of strength, but he will do for right now. And then let's go ahead and start setting up some agriculture. Uh, not him. He's going to be uh, he's going to be out in the, uh, up in um, Hangzhou. So okay. We have one, two, three, four. We'll set up one more ag right here. And the rest will be money. Throw some to Chin Lu. We're going to leave uh, one behind, which we will go ahead and leave her. Okay. Perfect. And let's go ahead and look at Chin Lu's city government's uh, strength. We are going to hold off on. We're looking at leadership, which is going to be Kowtow. Okay, let's get some money flowing.
Yeah, you can see these guys have low commerce. This is probably because this guy's out in the field. So, and when they're out in the field, they don't generate as much growth in these. Okay, and then Yuan Shu, Yuan Shao. Okay, and then these ones we will go ahead and set up for Ag. here. Okay, and then we need a few. So one, two, three. Actually, we need to change one of these. Uh, he's good enough politics. So four and four. And then let's set up some barracks. Insufficient. I need to drop one, it looks like. Distortion. Okay. And then let's go ahead and move on the next turn. Sanctions real fast, we're gonna recruit officers. Look at the overseer proposals, public order is my number one priority right now. In training. Okay. Let's go ahead and set that up for a strength. Uh no, not Diane Way. Let me set him up for barracks. Okay. And then we're going to look at city government. DNA. Okay. okay. Anybody who's not doing anything right now? Except for Hee Jin. Is going to come over here. Okay. We're going to go into our administration and finish this. I want that. And we might as well put that on there too. And we will take supply consumption, and if there's a one, we will take that. Perfect. Alright, let's reward anybody else we've gotten. Let's go ahead and go and look at our employment here. Okay. Try to employ him. Actually, let's go ahead and send Hijin up. It's 10 days, it'll be two turns, but that's okay. And then let's go ahead and jump into some searching. Try to pull out a couple more officers. I want tons and tons of officers. My previous playthroughs on this, I have become officer starved, which is something you really do not want. Like, there's just not enough officers around. Okay, let's go ahead and go to the next turn. Okay, 
Let's go. Okay, next step. Let's go ahead and let's move, transfer, make sure there's nobody in here we don't need. There's not. And then we're going to go ahead and move and transport troops out of here. So I'm going to take 20,000 troops. I'm going to take 15,000 gold. And then I'm going to take 30,000 food. 35,000 food. Okay, and we're going to bring this over here. Okay, and then we're going to move and tra transport. 50, uh, we'll do 1,300 troops. Not 13,000. 13,000. Yep, 13,000 troops. And another 20,000 food. That's going straight over here. Okay. So let's go ahead and reward everybody. Let's go ahead and summon anybody who is not doing anything. Oh, she needs to stay there. Yeah, we want to summon people here. Because we're going to be taking Hong Zong. All right, him, 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 and her, and him. Okay. Yep, that's good. So we're getting ready to move in, up into Hong Zong. And real quick, I know we got a couple more things we can do here. Uh, let's go ahead, what is she? Money. Okay. Let's go into our sanctions, let's look for recruits. Yeah. We're going to go to train, public order, and that's good. Let's knock out, um, reward, or what we have left. Let's go ahead and search some cities, starting with Chin Lu. And then we'll do the rest in Chinga. Okay, let's take a look closer here at the map and what we need to do. He's almost up here and I'll pick up these areas. Um, I'm going to need two guys back here. So we're going to make those... These two guys. Okay. All right, let's go ahead and go to sanctions. Let's recruit any officers. Let's look for any public order train. Let's reward everybody. 
Let's go for employments. Okay. And then let's go ahead and search all the cities. Alright, that's good. Now we can see the yellow turbans are already starting to spread out, but what it's doing is sending out their troops here. Is what, and that's what I want to see. Um, and that's why I'm bringing these guys down here. I'm going to kind of, uh, I'm really going to be pushing down south here into this area. those areas completely okay look at our sanctions let's recruit an officer hold a banquet training training public order Go ahead and reward all of our officers here. Go ahead and get ready for employments. If we have anybody that's free, okay, that'll be fine. Set up some area government stuff here. We should have a couple guys that aren't doing anything. Um. Let's go ahead and do commerce for him. And we'll just do agriculture for him. Oops. Okay, and then these areas are going to move into Hongzong, so I'm not going to set anybody up there. And let's go ahead and go into our titles. So this guy has, let's see. We're going to remove him. Going to strength, DN way. We're gonna remove him. Zhang He. We're gonna remove him too. Kowtow there. He has no business being an officer either. Set him up. Same with him. Yeah, he doesn't need to be an officer either. Uh, Yuan Xiao will leave there. He doesn't need to be an officer. Needed to see. Oh, what a mess. I hate doing this. Um, these guys are fine for right now. He needs to be a higher up. Get him. Now these guys can be officers. And what we'll do is we will um, go through and reorganize these a few different times. Okay. Look 
Magi. And we'll try not to piss a couple of these guys off so bad. Oh, we'll get him. We're gonna have some people that are not happy with that move, but we need to do what's necessary. Okay. I think I already did my appointments, right? Yeah. Let's go in and we're gonna pull up our top strength guys. Uh, he already has Iron Wall. What about Zhang He? We'll go ahead and train him. And this guy right here. I'll also give Iron Wall to. That's good. Let's look at specialty items. Why that guy has that, I don't know. Some of these guys up a little higher. So what I've noticed is some of these guys can only carry one weapon. So loyalty won't go down. This guy right here. Take another one. Yep, that's good. We're going to give that to Dian Wei. Oops. Okay, so that's good. They're always going to have retreat. This guy right here, he has no business having this sword. And if we, even if we lose him, I don't care. He already has one. Some of these guys could really benefit from this. Oh, what formation is this dude? He's a fish. So is he, and he's a ring too. Oh, give it to him. So we're gonna lose a lot of loyalty on this dude, but it's better to have it on him gotcha. than that dude. Okay. Now let's go ahead and go into our searching. Yi, Cheng An. Luoying. And then Chen. Okay, let's end that turn. Let's move forward, and then we're gonna. Once this transport gets over here, we're gonna actually start doing this stuff. this guy heading target his song your song song okay now this is a um Surround and conquer. Okay, so I need to start protecting my area real fast. 
because these guys are going to march all over the damn place and they're going to become a big annoyance specifically in this area so what i want to do is i'm going to defend this area real quick um let's see i need to march him out snake back that city Okay, where's he heading? Target design? That's up here. Okay. So that'll give me an opportunity to kind of grab everything here. I think I have that all pretty much in good order right now. Um, let's go ahead. Let's reward everybody. I know I got a guy with like really low, low loyalty. Let's hold a banquet. Let's recruit an officer. And let's train. Public order, public order. Public order, public order. Why, the reason why I put public order as such a high priority over everything else, and I'm not selecting everything, is um, because I don't want a bunch of rebels in my area. So... Let's send out some employments. Ejin is fine. Let's see, that's good. That's good. Already did my employments. My appointments are in order. So let's go ahead and march people out. Okay. Formations, we're not going to be doing any rings here. March max soldiers. We're going to reduce these each down to 6,000. Inspire, do surprise attack. Why don't you run him as a goose? Yep. Yep. Okay. Okay. Alright, so I'm going to advance them out here, but I'm going to go ahead and just start adjusting everybody. Uh, we're going to build an arrow tower starting off up here. He is going to build an arrow tower right here. He is going to build an arrow tower there. Right. He is going to build an arrow tower. Now these have to be two spaces away from each other. He is going to build an arrow tower. Two, you do one right there. No, you can't do one right there. There's only one space away, so we'll have to do it right here. He will build an arrow tower. Uh, one, two spaces away. He will build another arrow tower. And we will do one right here and then he will build a narrow tower and one two there we go so i'm just building a wall of arrow towers that way that these areas okay they at least have to go through something to start taking them from me okay that's good and i got plenty of food 
And let's go ahead and search. We'll send one guy up there. Come off and we'll put him on there. See if we have anybody else that has any special abilities like sight or connections. That's good. And then we'll do four. Okay, turn done. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to immediately move that way of healing. Suggestions. Um, we're gonna rise uh, unit morale. Train. Public order. Good. Now Hong Zong should be under my control. It is. We're gonna move. Actually, let's look at our domestic area government here and make sure nothing's changed. Okay, that's good. And we're going to move and transfer all these guys that aren't doing anything up to Hong Zong. And we're going to get that area set. Try to recruit that guy. He'll be the next option. Uh, already looked at suggestions. We've already rewarded every employment's already good. Appointments are good. Okay. A ram and a catapult, a ring. That's all he knows is catapult. We're gonna pull him out and we're gonna march these guys. Okay, we're gonna do a battling ram, an arrow, a goose, and a ring. That's fine. We're gonna max those soldiers out. And we're going to advance them down here. Now we're going to do, um, let's see, he's actually going to attack that. 28 days. So I want the rest of my guys to kind of arrive in the area around the same time. So we're going to relay him there. Relay him there. Relay him there. And then we're going to have him attack. Okay, we're going to have him relay here and attack. And then the ring, we will have him go up and attack. So this should be about 25 days. Okay, perfect. And we are going to rip down Wu Gate and go straight into Wong. Attack that guy. We're gonna have him attack that guy. And let's get some searches going. Uh, we're gonna start with Hong Zong. We'll send six guys down there.
actually. I think I just sent a bunch of guys out that aren't in a uh, good time frame. That's okay though. And let's move to the next turn. Right. Just readjusting myself here. Kind of setting in. Okay. Alright, that guy ran away. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and build that arrow tower. Needs to be two away from there. And we're gonna build another arrow tower that needs to be two away from there. Okay, he's got that arrow tower built. And let's go ahead and build one more right there, just to make it a pain in their butt. Let's go ahead and reward everybody. Recruit officer. Raise unit morale. Look at Overseer, Public Order, Public Order, and that's good. And got another officer to reward, one we just hired. Let's look for employments, none. Okay. Let's look at a couple specialty items. I know I just picked some up. Okay, life extension, we'll go ahead and give that to... Da, 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 da. Who are we going to give it to? Okay, he's fine. Okay, let's find somebody that's got some uh, high politics and let's just boost them up. He will be fine. Intelligence, same ordeal. And we'll choose one more with politics here. Uh, we will give it to him. Alright, things are already flowing pretty good here. Get my searches set. How many guys do we have still going up to Hong Zong? Plenty. Okay, we got a bunch of searches that are still heading to Hong Zong. And that will be my last. And we'll end this turn, and I think we're going to call the game right there. That's nice. Okay, we'll have him go ahead and attack him. And these guys are all still building their uh, building their towers. Okay. So that will be the end of uh, this Let's Play. Uh, we are at uh, May 184. Uh, Hee Jin, 
and we're almost ranked to noble we're getting ready to start doing movements we got hong zong that we picked up all of our areas are in order we just need to um we'll need to take this city over i'm just gonna let them do their thing for a little while and then uh take over the rest of the map all right guys uh thank you for watching and uh you know like subscribe all that jazz take it easy